Good morning, YouTube land. It is Thursday, February 1. And I just got up not too long ago. See, I'm treating you guys to my bed head. How do you like it? How do you like it? It's uh, really not that much different than how my hair looks on a regular basis anyway. I'm guessing. Well, actually, no, it is pretty bad right now. <laughs> so, hey, you guys get my bed head today. I just paid all of the rent and our bills, so now it's time to go out and do some fun stuff. Yay! Actually, no, we have to do some errands. Errand running. Lots of errand running today, and I'm taking you with me. So errand number one is a trip to the library because I had books to return, and I just want to like show that this place has more movies than a blockbuster. It's like they have almost, they have as many movies as they do books. It's ridiculous. It's like libraries are now video stores. <laughs> All these movies. More movies. More movies. More movies. So many movies. Obviously, I'm trying to be quiet because I'm in a library. So many movies. Oop, audiobooks. I listen to audiobooks on my commute. Oh, another aisle of movies. We're at the library to get books and to learn. Therefore, we're going to rent the two Annabelle movies. Stop number two in our day of errands. We need gas! We're at Wawa! Okay, I know how mean this is gonna sound and I'm not gonna show what I'm re referencing just cause I don't wanna be like super rude, but just word to the people out there, just because you can squeeze it over parts of your body doesn't mean it fits and doesn't mean you should. I'm all about body love, but just because you can get it on does not mean it fits. I feel a little bit like I need to clarify what I just said. There was a young lady at the gas station, and I'll go ahead and put another caveat on this. When it comes to revealing clothing, I'm, I'm very, very conservative and I'm very particular about it. Like, I don't feel like you need to run around showing your belly and your bottom of your butt cheeks and all that I just that's just a personal thing with me like I I'm okay with like shorts and tank tops and stuff like that but like yeah okay so this person was a, a very purport she was very large she's a big big girl and she was wearing um, like like capri leggings and a shirt that I recognized, like I actually recognized this tank top as being a full size tank top, like a regular tank top that would hang down to your waist, but she could only fit it over her boobs. And they were not encased inside a bra. And I'm guessing that this girl was maybe 20, 22 years old. That's what I was seeing, and that's what I commented on. So, if you're judging me for being like judging, <laughs> then that's kind of why I did it. But just because you can get it on your body doesn't mean it fits. Stop number two, we're at the Spectrum store because we need to turn in um, some equipment, some cable boxes. We no longer have cable. That's okay though. We were getting it for free because of my husband's work, but then our apartment's got like a contract with the cable company. So now if we want cable, we have to pay them for it because we're not allowed to have free cable where we live. Even though it's a perk of his, a benefit of his job, but whatever. So no cable for him. I bet you can't guess where our next stop was in our day of errands. Had to get no, the you, energized. You need to show it. Ah, now you can guess. <laughs> Starbucks. I don't notice I was looking at him. This guy is just parked across a couple of spaces. You know, because it's too hard to park correctly and 
he's important enough to do whatever he wants. Next stop on our list of errands is Costco! So we used to have a Sam's Club membership, but the Sam's Club closest to our house actually closed down. You know, because they was shut down like 63 of them. Yeah, that was the one nearest our house. And uh, wow. yeah, that was the one. <laughs> so we're gonna get a Costco membership because we've been talking about getting a Costco membership for ages okay. and anyway, so now we're gonna go do it. Yay! I just realized that we went to Costco and we didn't film any of it. But look, here is 200 something dollars worth of stuff. Lots of produce. What's that? And a case of eggs. <laughs> 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 it's funny. My neighbor here is telling me to film Courtney, <laughs> so I'm doing it. <laughs> We're filming, 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 filming Courtney carrying bags. <laughs> yeah. Our neighbor is funny. <laughs> So, yay, we wanted our cable turned off and guess what they shut off? Everything, you know what that means? No internet. I wonder how long it's gonna take for that to be working again. So it was just okay. like half the time it's been bummed out. So, I know. So the next stop on our day was going to Red Lobster. Um, did I mention the internet thing to the camera? Nope. Oh, yeah. So it was a little subdued because, like, we're having issues with our internet. Our internet has been cut off for a stupid reason that has to do with what I mentioned earlier about our apartment having, like, the bolt cable package, blah, blah, blah. So we don't have any internet for a while, and hopefully I'll be able to get this video uploaded by the end of tomorrow if I go somewhere with internet to do it because I don't want to break my streak. But yeah, it's kind of annoying and bad news, but whatever. I will make it work. I will find a way to still get my videos up. And these guys had Red Lobster for the very first time. Because I think, well, I think maybe I brought them once when they were little and they got like chicken strips. I don't really go to Red Lobster for seafood because I feel like there's so many other places to get seafood around here. But, but we wanted, Zachary wanted to try it and I was down for letting him try it. So we did. And thoughts? Uh, not a fan of lobsters much, but I love crab. He loves crab, not a fan of lobster, but the lobster. we'll try some other places anyway. Um, on camera, it looks like I have something on my lip, but in real life, I don't really have anything there. It's weird. Or do you? Well, I mean, I do, but it's not as dark in real life as it is on the camera. Jumbo. Troy liked his coconut shrimp. Yeah, they were delicious. All right, now we're gonna go next on our list of 10 million things to do today. We got to pick up Simon. Yeah. Okay. I have peripheral vision still. It's half there. Final errand of the day. We had to get a couple things we couldn't get at Costco, so we are at Walmart. Yeah, it's Walmart. So I just want to share with everybody. If I'm, if you ask me if I'm hungry, thirsty, or I have to go to the bathroom, the answer is yes. That's fine, he can play whatever he wants. All right, so day of running errands is over. Um, going to try to figure out a way to get this video uploaded tomorrow so that I'm on time and I don't mess up my streak. I don't know, I might have to go somewhere with internet or Wi-Fi or whatever and just do it from there, which we'll see if I have a chance to do it. I do have to work tomorrow. Um, so we're gonna end the night watching some Big Bang Theory on DVD because that's the only way we can watch anything. It's just crazy how wrapped up in internet our lives have become. But our internet has been turned off by our rental company because it was attached to the cable issue and uh, annoying. Long story. Anyway, tonight's country is Belarus. There's two official languages in Belarus. It's Russian and Belarusian. Okay, goodbye in Belarusian is da pebuchanya.